New York Yankees fans, how's it going yet again? This is Felix from NYNews.com. Like always, hola como estas? Let's get into some post-game commentary. The Yes Network uploaded a video where they just absolutely ethered the Yankees coaching staff. They outlined that Severino didn't even know when the game was going to start. They outlined that Severino only warmed up for about 20 minutes in total or something like that. Meaning that Aaron Boone, meaning that the Yankees coaching staff is not doing their jobs when, let's say, you have to remind certain players to pay attention and know when a game is exactly starting. You want to know why Severino did not perform? One, because he wasn't supposed to be pitching today. And two, because he barely warmed up. That is really, really disgraceful. It's playoff time. Is this the way your players are focusing? That they don't even know what time a game is supposed to start? And I love Severino. I'll go up to bat for him. But in my opinion, it's really not his fault if he doesn't know what time a game is starting. I think it's the manager's job to tell his team, oh yeah, the game is going to start at 740. Or you're not out there yet? Oops, my bad. I'll take responsibility for that. Did Aaron Boone come out in his post-game comments and say that? I highly doubt it. I don't know. I don't know at this point. If you guys know, leave a comment down below. But a Yankees fan, a username by the name of Long Island Yankees King said this. He said that the Yankees are flat out going to lose tomorrow because the Red Sox, Cora, is making the Yankees look like fools. And you know for a fact... Cora is going to bunt, steal, etc. on CC. So you know what is being said now? Because of this pathetic performance today, that Jay Happ has to pitch tomorrow. Jay Happ, who had a similar game to Severino, he has to pitch tomorrow. I don't know how I feel about that. The season on the line with somebody that hasn't been on the Yankees all season long. We don't know how he's built. We haven't seen him perform on the Yankees come playoff time. At least with CeCe, we have. But it's pretty much impossible to pitch CeCe when Alex Cora is making Aaron Boone look like a fool. So now the Yankees season comes down to if Jay Happ can give them innings, pitch a great game, and let's say the Yankees snap out of getting their asses spanked, today and use that as motivation to tie the series up so let's say they do tie the series up game five the yankees are possibly going to have to use their bullpen to start the game because if you start cc sabathia alex cora straight up mr disrespect is going to bun on him steal bases even if they're leading by 10 or 20 runs he's still going to do it how do we say it over here in New York City? The Yankees are straight up getting violated. Straight up getting violated. And to make it worse as it is, they're letting it happen. Can Jay Hap make it happen <laughs> to light things up on a horrible situation? Can Jay Hap make it happen? Let's make it the happening. Stanton, hello, where are you? Let's make it stappening when we all heard the news that John Cole Stanton was about to be traded to the Yankees. We need those guys to step up. CeCe Zabathi is a great leader. And too bad the Yankees are probably not going to use him this series. Because like I said, Alex Cora is a savage. If this was prison, yeah, the Yankees would be his you-know-what right now. Yankees fans, like always, leave your opinions in the comment section below. And like always, this has been Felix from m1news.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you out next time.